Hi guys, and welcome to Let's Play The Sims 3. Um, this will be my first uh, mini series LP, and uh, let me tell you what an, what I mean by mini series LP thing. Um, these will these will consist of anywhere between 10 to 15 parts, or around that. Um, and I will do them probably between expansion packs or. Um, even, you know, maybe even between The Sims 3 and The Sims 4. <laughs> like, I'll do them from time to time. Not very often, so don't, like, request a million. Um, but, uh, um, and what I mean by I'll do them, I mean I'll have, like, an entire series. That's what I mean by them. But these parts I'll probably be uploading uh, very regularly because my pet LP is ending very soon. Um, part 43 ha should be up right now. Um, so go ahead and check that out. Um... Yeah, and uh, I I really hope you guys like this. We're gonna do this one in Lunar Lakes. As you can see, I keep like moving around. Um, we're gonna do this in Lunar Lakes because I love it. It is seriously one of my new favorite neighborhoods um, next to Bridgeport. I love Bridgeport because I love The Sims. Um, because I love The Sims in Bridgeport, and I love the look of Bridgeport as well. I haven't really gotten a chance to meet all of The Sims, or majority, or even majority of The Sims in Lunar Lakes. But I am um, really excited to play this and uh, do this for you guys. Um, this will not focus on any specific stuff pack or expansion pack. It will just be me playing the game with all of my content, including store content, stuff pack content, and expansion pack content, um, how I would normally play the game. Um, so... Uh, yeah. Now, um, just so you'll know that it's a part of my mini series, there will be, um, in the title somewhere, there'll be like an MS mini series one, and it'll be like the whole one, but it'll be like a different part. You'll, you guys will get to know this <laughs> after a while. You'll, you'll, you will understand my logic to like this, this crazy mind of mine. Um, but oh, Ollie's so cute. He's licking his balls. How adorable. <laughs> Anyways, I am rambling way too much. Let's go ahead and jump into create a household. We're going to go ahead and create one sim. Um, a girl. Duh, I'm a girl. And I want her to be a ghost hunter. Why do I want her to be a ghost hunter? That is like one of my favorite careers there is. Um, I love the ghost hunter profession and everything like that. Ollie's like, he's trying to choke on something and I'm trying to stop him so he doesn't like ruin this. Ollie, go die in a hole. Go, seriously, go. Go. He's like going to ruin my life. I know it. I know it. Anyways, um, <laughs> let's go ahead and create a sim here. You guys pretty much know how I, how I go with this. Uh, she looks fine. All right, let's see here. We're going to name her... We're going to name her, um, I have candle wax on my hand for some reason. We're going to name her Eliza. Uh, I'm going to name her Eliza Thornberry. If you guys know where that is from, without Googling it, you are fucking badass. That's all I'm going to say. You are a fucking badass. That, yeah, that's it. <laughs> so we're going to name her Eliza Thornberry. Let's see here. And I'm going to go ahead and take this off here. Because I want her to have different hairstyles for outfits and things. Um, like seriously, one of the, the downfalls for having so much store content and expansion con pack content and stuff pack. Just so much content in general. Is that like... Um, is like... It's hard to, de to decide what you want, you know, because I love, like, okay, I'm going to show you some of my favorite hairstyles. This is one. This is definitely one. I, fuck, look at that. Amazing. Absolutely amazing. Um, what else is there? Like, I think I like this one. <laughs> I do. It's very, um, oldies, but I like it. Um, that's all over the place. I like that. This is one of my favorites right here. This is a favorite. This is a favorite. And we haven't even gotten to the hair with accessories. This is a favorite. Like, it's it's hard to kind of choose what you want. But I want her to be a ghost hunter. So I'm going to give her something a little bit more, um, something a little bit more edgy, I guess. Uh, not, um, 
not so prissy and tamed. Um, let's go ahead and give her. Let's give her. Let's give her the braid. Yeah, let's give her the braid. Let's see here. Um, and then her eyebrows. Match your root hair. Oh, those are a little too thick. Okay, there you go. And, <clears throat> let's see. I'm sorry I'm coughing. I don't mean to, but I do. I don't know how I want her head shape to go. This is also, like, kind of hard for me, <laughs> choosing a head shape. <laughs> uh, let's see. And her eyes. Can I... Mm, Now, I normally like, like, I like to, I've, I've started liking taking times and going into, like, the advanced settings and really, really moving things around. But for this LP, I don't want to, I don't want to spend too much time on that. I think I will, like, pre-make Sims or something for my Showtime LP. We will see. I'm going to give her freckles because I like, I like the freckles. <laughs> uh, let's see here. And... A little bit of eyeliner and some blush and contouring and is that too girly for a, go for a ghost hunter no not at all not at all it's perfect it's perfect I love it okay let's go into everyday attire hmm hmm and I, you know what, I'll, if I if I remember, I'll put this in on the exchange so you guys can download her if you want. If you want. <laughs> um, let's see here. I don't know what to give her. I think I'll give her this. And... I don't know what I want to do. Isn't this a little too risque for a ghost hunter? I mean, a little bit. I never put socks on my Sims. Is that weird? Like ever? Let me see here. Hmm, I don't really want that. <clears throat> Let me find something else. Come on, load, damn it. I have like so many outfits, that's what's taking so long to load. Like all of these outfits have to load. This is the outfit that actually came with Lunar Lakes. Look at how like out there this is. Like it's really, really out there. I wish, oh god, I wish that like you could, what am I breaking, one second, I'm like spilling, some, spilling something, okay, mm. I'm like totally ruining my, my desk, some of you know how messy my desk is, <laughs> but uh, yeah, I'm like, yeah, there's a can of soda that's been there for like a couple of weeks, that I just almost knocked over. I guess we can let her wear this. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's not necessarily Ghost Hunter, like either. I'm more of like, I don't know. I think I want to make her like a not so much of a girly girl, but <clears throat> but it looks like that's what like I'm leaning towards. I mean, I guess it's not super girly girlish, right? No, yeah, mm-hmm. This. I like this. I'll give her that, because I like that. And maybe some sneakers to go with that? Or what should I do? God, I could sit, seriously, I could sit here for days. I don't really like those wedges with that. Maybe some white heels. No, let's go with some flip-flops. You can't go wrong with flip-flops. 
Yeah, I guess you can. <laughs> I guess you can, because it doesn't, I don't like that either. Um, you know what? It's going to have to fucking work. It will. And then let's go to hair. Her formal attire. Oh my, can you say skinkatron? Uh, let's see here. Um, I forgot, what did her hair look like at first? Oh, that ponytail, the braid. Um, because I don't want to like give her the ponytail with the braid and then give her like a short hairstyle when it comes to this. It'll just look way too weird. I'm like kind of anal about things like that. Um, maybe something like this. Is that too out there? I love it. It came with the uh, More Magic um, set from the Sims 3 store. Absolutely love it. And then we're just gonna find her a nice dress. Maybe this. <clears throat> it looks like it would kind of go with that. I'm already spending like 50 years creating her. Just like one sim. Nope, I don't like it. Oh, I kind of do like it. Yeah, I like it, but those fucking shoes. <clears throat> Let's see here. There we go. I could go in and give her some accessories, but again, I'm trying not to take 50 years with this. <laughs> um, and we're going to go here. And then we're going to give her the bun. You guys, some of you might know the bun. I love the bun. I showed it a, a minute ago, but this bun it's from the sims 3 store i love this hairstyle i guess because like i i can see myself like wearing this hairstyle like a lot like just a bun on top of your head you know like when you're you wake up and you have to go somewhere and you don't really feel like doing anything with your hair yeah that's what i would run to i love these little shorts too they're so cute And that's what she's going to sleep in. Um, athletic attire. <clears throat> I actually like this. I think I'm going to keep that. But I'm going to give her a switch of the hairstyle and make it something like that. A little bit more messier and take off those shades. <clears throat> I don't know one person in the world that would wear shades while working out. I don't. Oopsie. Now time for swimwear. As you can. Uh, let's go for this. This came with Master Sweet stuff. But if you can't tell. <laughs> um. Mm. <laughs> I guess she can wear that with her hairstyle. Okay, now time to choose your treats. Again, I want her to be a ghost hunter. So I'm going to. I don't even know. What do ghost hunters need? I forgot. Do they need, like, logic? I think they need logic. I don't remember. So we are going to give her... We're going to give her the natural cook. The neurotic. Of course. Um, we're going to make her brave. Um, and we're going to make her flirty. Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and then we're gonna make her um well, let's make her rebellious I'm a nurse. fuck yeah all right and she's gonna want to be a heartbreaker so pretty much heartbreaker she wants to have like multiple boyfriends it says uh for those of you that don't know um that lifetime wish came with late night <laughs> i'm sorry if you feel if i feel the need to explain all of like where this where these things came from um i know not everyone has every stuff pack expansion pack and every you know piece of store content so i like to let you guys know where these things come from so you're not wondering oh my god i want that lifetime wish or i want that hair or that piece of furniture or that career or whatever anyways okay so um it says be the girlfriend of 10 different sims why settle for a long-term a romantic relationship or monogamy when there are so many attractive sims out there your sim can find a lifetime 
enjoyment by seeing many different sims. Such a romantically nomadic lifestyle is all is all well and good. If your sims many formal former lovers can be kept at a reasonably safe distance, um, lest jealousy rear its vengeful head. That happens all the time to me. I've tried. I've n this has been like one lifetime wish that I cannot accomplish. Like it is just so hard for me to do. I don't know why. So her favorite food is going to be cheese stick. Favorite music is going to be custom. Even though I want to switch up my custom. There's like a bunch of Taylor Swift and Demi Lovato in there. <laughs> I want to kind of add some new music uh, new music to it. I really love Katy Perry's new song. Like I am in love with Katy Perry's new song. I also like, oh, let's make sure. What's her voice again? Because I always forget about her. Tom to, no. That looks fine. Um, okay, Bobby. but <clears throat> like I really, 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 really like Katy Perry's new song. Um, I love the Rihanna and Chris Brown remix of Birthday Cake. Um, what else do I love right now? I think that's like it. <laughs> I don't listen to much music. Um, I don't know. I like Taylor Swift's new Safe and Sound, Safe and Sound song too. Um, that's like it. Now there, are th there are a bunch of houses that you can get when you like available when it comes to Lunar Lakes when you just know starting off as a sim with no cheats. One thing, you see this little I call it a crop circle. Hugo called it something else. It looks like a fucking crop circle. <laughs> Even though it's that's not like a crop field. Like it's not a field of crops. So I don't know. Anyways, this little thing right here. This house. Don't, don't, don't do it. It is the weirdest house in the world. I promise you, you will not be able to see your sim half the time. And like going up and down levels constantly is a pain in the fucking ass. Don't do it. Don't do it. Um... I'm going to stick with this house that I, I love. Up here, I really, really like this house um, right here. Functional fungi. Um, and then this house over here. And then there is this house right here. It is called the Outpost, um, which is what I would love to go in. But it doesn't have room for a double bed. So keep that in, I think that's the one that didn't have room for a double bed. So keep that in mind um, when doing all of this stuff. So we're going to go into functional fungi here and we're going to furnish this house. Actually, no, we're going to buy the house already furnished because I kind of like the way that it comes furnished a little bit. Loading. No loading screens in my ass. I swear that says loading. I could be wrong. Maybe I don't know how to read. Well, I don't know how to read. But anyways, this is the house. Oh, bedroom. Okay, I'll show you guys. It's with the roofs up. This is what it looks like. Look at that fucking house. How awesome is that house? Like, like look at that. It just, it's gorgeous. Like, oh, God, I love Lunar Lakes. Look at these trees. Come on. Come on. Okay, enough of that. Enough of me. <laughs> um, on the first floor, when you walk in, you have the bedroom. It looks like this. It's a simple, a little cheap bed, mirror plant, you know, and blah, blah, blah. And then going upstairs, you have, like, a, diff a separate room outside for your bathroom and shower, which is, doesn't look too bad. And then you have, like, your television here and kitchen area, blah, 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 blah. I'm actually going to swap this out. I'm going to bring this couch back a little bit here. And, um buy a new television there we go just a better one I guess and she wants to be a firefighter not gonna happen doll we're gonna make you a fucking ghost hunter where's the science building right here join the ghost hunter profession <clears throat> and watch how long it, it takes in lunar lakes to get somewhere it takes forever. Come on, dude. It takes forever to get somewhere. We're just gonna stay here and chill for a minute. Cause she has so she has like so far to go. Like I'll I'll just bag it up here. She has to go look at 
she has to go through all of this and you see how slow she's fucking moving go through all of that all the way down this long hill do you see how long it's taking her all the way around here all the way around here and oh she's gonna go down here <laughs> she's gonna go down this road but still you see how long it's taking her to travel in in lunar lakes i think that's like the only downfall to this um neighborhood but it doesn't really bother me because i don't give a fuck if my sins are late to work um and then you know eventually when you play for a couple of generations with no cheats or with cheats you'll have a fast car so it doesn't really matter so we're about to go into the science facility here and we are about to um we're about to join the ghost hunter profession and it's from 5 p.m to 3 a.m and it says uh, ghosts and spirits are wandering out of their graveyards um and the catacombs uh locals are terrified and children cannot sleep through the night who's the town to call you <laughs> if you have a taste for the oh shit metaphysical look at that <laughs> well, don't you do that you look at a word like you've never seen before because i've never seen that word before and it freaks you out for a hot second then you just look at it again and you're like oh okay metaphysical <laughs> and the courage to combat the paranormal all right so accept that career and we need a logic skill. I knew we needed the fucking logic skill. So we're just going to have her go ahead and go home. And we're going to stop this first part here. I hope you guys enjoyed this as much as I did. Because I, I love creating a new family. And like doing like mini LPs like this. And it's, it's, it's only going to be a couple of parts. And the parts I'm going to try to make them uh, longer. <clears throat> coughing. Longer than usual. Like um... I'm going to try to make them about an hour long after this part, because I know this part isn't an hour, but I'm going to try to make them about at least an hour long, um, because there will be so few, but I tend to just play the game, and wherever I feel, like, she's not even home yet, look at that, wherever I feel like <laughs> it's a good stopping point, that's where I stop, but, um, I can try, um, so, what we're going to do is I want you guys to like this video don't forget to like this video don't forget to visit queen.com don't forget to subscribe what else what else that's it yeah <laughs> all right guys so you all have a super fantastic awesome splendid amazing day i will put this sim on the exchange um today or tomorrow probably i don't know i have homework to do so bear with me here and i love you all and she's freaking out weirdo <laughs> you guys have a good day a super fantastic awesome splendid amazing superb extraordinary really 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 good day bye guys